Whitney Way Thor has been an inspiration in my big fat fabulous life, but unfortunately, she's become her own worst enemy. The reality star's vision of conquering the world by shattering stereotypes and redefining standards in the world of dance has stalled. Her bigger-than-life dreams and aspirations have taken a nosedive, and Whitney is the only one standing in her way. My big fat fabulous life's Whitney Way Thor shook up people's preconceived notions and judgments with her brazen and confident attitude. The 38-year-old has always had a passion for dance that started at a young age and continued throughout high school and college. When Whitney was faced with a life-changing hormonal disorder, PCOS, polycystic ovary syndrome, her whole world was turned on its head. However, despite the side effects, such as rapid weight gain, she didn't let it define her or stop her from dancing to the beat of her own drum. My big fat fabulous life's Whitney Thor had a mission Whitney had a mission to encourage others not to give up on their dreams and to prove that limitations are only a mindset. Before reaching my big fat fabulous life fame, Whitney used her platform on YouTube to express herself through dance and inspire others not to abandon what they love. Whitney partnered up with her friend, Todd Beasley, to create fun choreographed dance videos on YouTube and taught her followers the moves. She was praised for her authentic personality because she embraced her weight instead of trying to work against it. It wasn't long before Whitney amassed an impressive following on her YouTube channel. She didn't only teach dance moves, but she also spoke her mind and didn't shy away from uncomfortable topics. After learning to live life at a new weight, it came with its own set of challenges that weren't connected to a scale. Whitney faced judgment and ridicule because of her bigger size, and she addressed many of her experiences in her videos. Whitney also directly confronted online body shamers and brought awareness to bias associated with weight in the media. She quickly became an inspiration to many as she championed against bullying and explained the importance of self-love at any size. It wasn't long before she landed her reality show, my big fat fabulous life, and the capability of reaching a broader audience with her message and sharing her story with the world. My big fat fabulous life changed Whitney Thor's trajectory when Whitney started to share her life on my big fat fabulous life. She was focused on her dance career, making a difference in others' lives, and staying true to herself. Even though she struggled with the ups and downs of her weight and subsequent body issues, she never let a number on the scale hinder her in any way. Whitney defied stereotypes and prejudices, all while doing what she loved and living her life to the fullest. Throughout the seasons of My Big Fat Fabulous Life, Whitney's priorities have dramatically shifted. Her goals and aspirations have been replaced with romantic pursuits as her love life has been front and center. It was never a secret that the reality star was looking for love, but she has become heavily invested in finding her happily ever after. Unfortunately, she hasn't been very successful in finding her knight in shining armor and, instead, has wound up with a broken heart time and time again. From following Whitney on her journey of first dates to more serious relationships, nothing has panned out. Whitney's dramatic and troubled relationships have become the highlight of my big fat fabulous life rather than her inspirational endeavors. Her determined spirit and fervent passion for making a difference in her life and the lives of others through her bold approach have slowly lost their spark. 
Whitney Thor's definition of success has changed since Whitney rose to fame on My Big Fat Fabulous Life. She has been exposed to more opportunities. Aside from reality television recognition, she has also partnered up with different companies and brands. She initially used her platform as an extension of her overarching goal of helping others feel more comfortable in their skin. Now she seems to have become more comfortable being a spokesperson for various brands even if it doesn't align with her previous mission or beliefs. Whitney's constant promotional ads have become more of a plug rather than a product she truly believes in. Whitney's entire perspective has changed in my big fat fabulous life, and she has gotten lost in the pressures of reality fame. Her strong and resilient nature has morphed into someone that no longer has that same sense of drive and motivation. She no longer has her ambitions and dreams mapped out and has admitted through her Instagram stories that she spends much of her time alone. Whitney's close circle of friends has also taken a hit because of her behavior. The reality star has always been respected for her views on body positivity, but she hasn't extended that same belief to her friends. Whitney humiliated Buddy Bell because of his weight, and seeing her abandon her strong values and convictions has been surprising. Now she often wallows in self-pity and attempts to bring her friends down to her level instead of pulling herself up by the bootstraps with no excuses like she used to. Unfortunately, Whitney's current frame of mind has been her downfall in my big fat, fabulous life. As she has gotten caught up in finding Mr. Right, the fallout from those relationships has taken a toll on her mentally and emotionally. Instead of focusing on herself and what she wants to accomplish, she is distracted by what she doesn't have. Whitney used to lean on her family and friends for support, advice, and guidance, but she has chosen to go her own way at the expense of everything she once held dear. Sources. Whitney Thor, YouTube. Whitney Thor, Instagram. Yeah.